Hey man, you talking to motherfucking bands too Put it on, I'm rocking with one to come a podcast, you feel me? Greetings, my people. Welcome to another episode of On The Come Up Podcast with your host, Ace, DJ Ace. And I'm here with an artist from Linden, New Jersey, Brooklyn, New York, you know, That's different vibes. You Brooklyn, like I play for Nets. You know what I'm saying? Enjoy yourself, brother. Talk to him. You feel me, man? It's Mr. Ax about it. Mr. Benz 2.0. You feel me? 2Z is 2.0. I'm going to get it wrong. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Mr. Benz. How you doing, sir? You doing, Ace? What's good, man? Can't complain, you know? Taking it day by day, it's 2022, you know? We gotta get it. New year, new everything. New, new. everything, yeah. Everything, we, new. Yeah, we gotta go crazy. Definitely. So, for those who don't know who you are, just wanna get a little backstory of where you started, where you're coming from, all that shit. Talk to me. Okay, okay, okay. I mean, uh, I was born and raised in Brooklyn and shit, you feel me? Right. Star shit, man. Smurfville, Peas, you feel me? Trenches, you feel me? Right. Like, I just, I, I don't know. I kept going from trench to trench, you feel me? Yeah. Dude, we got it right. <laughs> so, Respect. Respect. That's how it is, but, um, yeah. Again, born and raised in Brooklyn, you feel me? Moved to Jersey and shit. Jersey City then ended up in London. That's why I grounded myself, right, right, you feel right. me? Okay, moved okay. to Jersey, you feel me? Oh, you moved because, like, parents type shit, or you just moving around? Oh, yeah, yeah, you feel me? I, was, I moved with my pops and shit, you uh, feel me? Like, right, right. yeah, word. It was about that time. Right, right, right. I would say before we even start into the music shit, like I would say with the uh when you coming from Brooklyn, you think that influenced you? Making music? Hell yeah. On the Brooklyn side. I ain't gonna hold you. I was always some little badass nigga just yeah. rapping and shit. Like right, you right, feel right, me? Right, but right, like, right. like I ain't I'ma keep it a hundred. When I was in Brooklyn and shit, I ain't know nothing about no sports, no nothing, my nigga. Yeah. That ass, like just doing it. That's all I knew. Was Outside. Just, you feel me? Yeah. Real shit, you feel me? I ain't know nothing about no sports, no nothing, like so basically like and I was a big ass 50 Cent fan, you feel mm, me? Heavy. No cat. Right. Definitely so. Hell yeah, I say hell yeah, that shit influenced me. He's a, he's a major influence in your music today, still? Nah, 50 old head. Oh, I <laughs> fuck with 50 though. You know what I mean? I fuck with 50 though, but. You feel me? Are you fucking with on the Brooklyn side right now? Are you still you tap into that or hell not? Hell yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, hell okay, yeah. Okay. I still be going into that sometimes, yeah. you feel me? Like, but, um, it's a, it's a couple niggas underground, you feel me? I found my son John Cena, you feel me? From my mm-hmm. hunting shit. It's my dog. Fucking, uh, 26 AR. Fucking. Crazy. I don't really. I'm keeping a 100 though. I don't really. That drill shit ain't really like. I don't, it I don't ain't really, really your vibe, your yeah, Steve. It ain't my vibe, man. Word, word. Respect to them vibe. guys, though. They doing nah, their Yeah, thing. definitely respect to them. Yeah. They doing their thing, but they ain't my thing. So, mm-hmm. like, I would say, speaking into that, like, what inspired you to make music? And we'll go after that. What 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 type of music do you even make? I right, boom. Inspired me, me. Fucking keep it a hundred. I was always rapping and shit, you feel me? But I told you like when I moved to Jersey and shit, I got into the sports tape shit, you feel me? Okay. Got into it, so went what back sports to you was doing though? Football. I went back okay, to New okay. York and shit, you feel yeah. me? Do it college out there, shit, you feel me? Shit ain't work out. Yeah. yeah what position? Man. Corner. Yeah? Hell yeah. Fast? Man. Hell yeah. Man. Yeah? I'm gonna have to see you on the uh, on the field one time. Four three shit. Yeah, besides that, fucking, I ended up getting into trouble and shit out there. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Got kicked out of school. Mm-hmm. As soon as I got kicked out, I came right back to the just went to the studio, literally. Right. Okay. You know what I'm saying? So. You always had that rapping in you, or you just did it because like your people's around. Oh no, you I always had that shit in me. Okay, I always had that shit in me. It's just that when I felt like football was over, you feel me? Mm. I went to the next best thing best I was good thing. at. You okay. feel me? Okay. So, so even when you was out there, you was rapping like writing. Hell yeah, I um, I was in the funny part about it. I was in college and shit, and I had made like two songs. You feel me? Setback and uh fucking. Freestyle to uh that G Herbo shit when you, you from me moving shows. Yeah, and shit. yeah, yeah. Uh that shit end up getting uh played on like a um a series XM radio or some oh, yeah? shit like that. It was like a uh a Rutgers University yeah. fucking um radio shit. Right, right. You feel me? With my son, um Yeah, I can what was my name? Uh from Love 9, my son B-Side. Mm. Shout out B-Side, you feel me? Yeah, definitely. We started off going crazy together, no cap. That's fine. Son B-Side. That's fine. But, um, hell yeah, like, 
he got me on that radio shit and I was in, I was literally in my dorm like waiting for the countdown yeah, everybody you feel me yeah, that, yeah, yeah real shit that's like, hard shit was going crazy man what was that reception everybody when you heard your uh, your record on the radio motherfuckers ain't motherfuckers ain't even know I could rap yeah? yeah cause I wasn't in college rapping oh, okay. and shit yeah yeah, yeah. So. Nah, when niggas heard that, you shit, you feel me? Motherfuckers started fucking with my Fuck music with and shit. But yeah, like I barely was going to the studio and shit. I just made them two songs and okay. that shit ended up happening. You feel me? So once I got kicked out, I went right back to the studio. Like and literally. You took it serious. I took that shit serious. Okay. Uh, that's fire. That's fire. Yeah. So I asked you, what type of uh, music would you like normally make? What's your style? You a boom bap? You a rapper rapper? You a drill rapper? You know. I'm a rapper rapper. Cause you gonna feel my shit if mm-hmm. you if you been through it whatever you gonna feel it okay I'm like then I could get melodic you feel okay. me I get melodic a lot you know what I'm saying like I rap rap even when I'm melodic there's bars in it like okay. you gonna catch it you feel yeah me? I know how to make a song okay a complete song you feel me not a lot of people could do that though yeah you not a lot of people be making like one minute thirty second two minute for the TikToks and shit but yeah yeah yeah, yeah right, it's, a lot, it's a lot of a lot of people that don't know how they just like to do catchy shit not an actual but I'm not gonna lie though if you if you got a uh if you got a motherfucking hook verse hook verse yeah and your song's still two minutes and thirty minutes that's a complete song to me yeah for sure I mean, yeah for sure, for sure. It's, it's a lot of motherfuckers that can't do that though they can't. Yeah, they can't, they can't, they can't. Definitely. <laughs> What's your process like? Do you write? Do you go off top? Yeah, like, or are you an in, uh, in studio type of guy? Or are you at home type yo, of guy? My process changed. Like, Talk to me. As I was, you feel me? Like, I right, boom. Like, my process started off in a motherfucking closet with a laptop. Right. <laughs> okay. No like, everybody. A yeah. little ass closet. Yeah. Like, laptop. Like, yeah. you feel me? Yeah. And, uh, I always used to write. I mean, always mm. used to write. I stopped writing like I say about like 2019 and start rapping. Wow. Start writing. You started writing. Stop. Oh, writing. Stop writing. Stop Why? Writing. Why you stop? I don't know. It was just. It got easier I to start, you. Yeah, the shit got too easy. Okay. You feel me? And yeah. I was like, you feel me? It really got too easy. Yeah. So, you feel me? And sometimes motherfuckers can tell the difference if I was freestyling or writing the shit. Wow. Hey, you feel me? So you haven't wrote since. Now well, I went back to writing. Oh, hell okay, yeah, okay, okay, okay. you gotta go back to writing. Yeah. I don't care. Nobody say you feel me. Your music gonna change. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. you gotta go back to writing. Like that's that's. You feel me? Right. No matter what, like, yeah, that's how you make your complete songs. You feel me? Right. Oh, yeah. That's okay, it. for sure. So I'll ask another question. Uh, people listening to your songs and that, do you have any people that they say, oh, you sound similar to, oh, like, oh, you sound like this artist, or you sound like a Dave East, or you sound like so and so and so. So you have any comparisons or like you? Just on your own. You got your own unique sound. Ain't nobody comparing you to nobody. I got my own unique sound. Okay. You hear that? You feel me? I ain't even got to say too much. Yeah. You hear that? <laughs> I don't know what you call it. Like, your that, tag just, or your ad lib, right? Yeah, that's my tag right okay. there. Like, let me pretend you feel me. I got to let you know who one is. You feel me? But I, I feel like I don't really get compared to people because like, it's me. Like, I don't right. know. Like, people, like, motherfuckers know I ain't. Like my shit coming out as me, like you feel me? So right. ain't nothing to be, ain't nothing to be compared. Okay, so. for sure. So I would say when you started rapping, were people taking you serious or people was just like, man, nah, he. I'm gonna say some real shit. You know it's crazy. It's motherfuckers that ain't used to take me serious, like, at like it's motherfuckers that like, boom, that like, he's just charge me mm. for a feat. You feel me? Like, yeah. That shit changed within seven months. Yeah. Like, Okay, like uh, that shit changed, like that shit changed drastically. Yeah. So like definitely like motherfuckers started wanting features from me. Yeah. And did you do are you the type of person who double back and be like, I'm gonna charge you, I'm gonna charge your arm in the band, or are you just like it is what it is? Came with the game type shit. Nah, I don't come with the game. I don't go in the game. <laughs> nah, some people be humble, be like, I I, I, I can see why you don't even wanna fuck with me, but we could work and there's other nah, people but like, be like Suck my dick respectfully. If, if you gonna tell me my shit hard and fuck with my shit like that, don't you feel me? And then try to nah, man, do that other shit. That. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not doing that I, shit. I, I definitely understand. That's you what I'm saying. Me? There's two sides of how you play it. If, nah, definitely. If, if, if you wanna play it like still that. humble about this shit, yeah. but it, you feel me? That should go both ways. Bro. Nah, I understand. Definitely. I asked another question though. Hypothetical. If you had a chance to open up for an artist, what 
artist would you open for that you would have a similar sound or what artist that you would open for would have the same type of fan base that you know their fans will fuck with your you feel me your style of music I said dirt dirt definitely mm. why you say that just the topics y'all talk about I ain't heard you. yeah and like that nigga influenced me a lot I ain't gonna lie cause I remember I was listening to Dirk when when Dirk wasn't where he is now right, you right, feel right. me and motherfuckers used to count him out and bro took that that little time off yeah. came back you feel me and then it Grinded was over it after up. that you feel yeah. me like definitely Hell yeah. Took himself out that deal and then started going definitely shit crazy. Started, you feel me? Yeah, I definitely understand. Yeah, definitely that. dirt. Hell yeah. I'll say another question for you. What's the one song that got people to say, oh yeah, you lit? You are. Bro. I made the song called How. Mm. You feel me? Where people can find that? On YouTube, YouTube. Apple Music, Spotify, Band, wherever. Bands 2.0? Yeah, Bands 2.0. BND Double Z 2.0. You feel me? No spaces, no together that's that one song how how'd that come about no pun intended <laughs> no bullshit i think i just wrote that shit one day mm. no cat but you got the beat already the beat. Okay. i wrote that shit feel me and then like i always like when i make some shit i always rap it to people to see how that shit you feel me mm. motherfuckers like nah like that's it that's so i end shit. up doing like an instagram video you feel me oh yeah Shit went blood, like yeah. shit went crazy. Yo, after that, it's um, some turnt shit. Like, what type of vibe is it? Some some slow shit, slow rapping, nah, fat, like, some turnt shit, or some uh, melodic I, type. I describe that shit. It's melodic, okay. but it's like I'm talking. Okay, yeah. You feel me? Like, you gonna you gonna feel it? Like, yeah. feel me? Especially if you from my city, you feel me? Right, especially okay. if you from the fog. Um, fucking yeah, like I did that shit. Then everybody like nah. Grassroots videos and shit, blah, blah, this thing, they're like, you feel me? All right, motherfucking. This when shit started getting crazy, like, I started, like, making friends, like, you feel me? Making connections and shit, you feel right, me? Right. Then we got this, like, this little day, like, called War Day, you feel me? From, like, my part day, my right. hood day, so, you feel me? I, and I was supposed to perform and shit. I basically did perform, but I shot a video out there, like, you feel me? More than a thousand people, everybody, you feel me? Right. You, know, you see the shit, like, oh, right. yeah. Definitely, you feel me? That's on YouTube as well, or yeah, that's, that's, on in, YouTube. that's in that's the, the video? video. That's oh, the video. okay, 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 okay. I mean, yeah, definitely. Had the me out there and all that. The whole yeah. city, like. Turn. After that, it was it was ball game. Turn, 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 turn. So everybody, once that record came out, niggas was fucking with you. Yeah, like, once yeah. that record came out, like everything started. You feel me? Everything falling online. Fall on definitely. Or, so I would say, looking at the artist that's coming out right now, who's somebody that you like working with? Or who's somebody that you want to work with? Well, I'll start with who, uh, who's somebody you Underground like. Underground industry. Both. Um, yo, no, no cap. I fuck with, uh, I fuck with a lot of, uh, Detroit rappers. Mm. I mean, niggas talk they shit. I fuck with that shit. Yeah. Like, heavy, like, like Shout out Babyface one time. Shout out Babyface, definitely. Shout out Rio, for real. Yeah. Man. Definitely. Um, nah, yeah, I definitely fuck with the Detroit movement. Like, yeah. Fuck with that shit heavy. Oh, Not everybody, cool. but most, most of them. Yeah, they, like, they be yeah. talking they shit. Them niggas talk that shit. That they, shit. They just, about they shit me? too. That they shit funny. They show it. Yeah, yeah. That shit hard. But um, yeah, definitely. Fucking Y and J. I mean, cause them niggas bring out that energy. All right. I mean, make you want to talk your shit. Like right. so. Yeah, definitely. That's what it is. Okay. Okay. Anybody on this side? Anybody on this side? Um, honestly. I, I work with uh I work with a lot of I got a lot of homies that rap. Okay. You feel me? So I work with my homies. I don't really be too eager to. What's the names? Drop them. Drop some names for them. Show some love. The homies. Show the homies some love and all that. You know what I mean? I got shout out my son OGD. Yeah. Real ones. Got shout out my son uh Glow. You feel me? Definitely. I keep telling my I keep telling my son Baller to take this shit serious. He, I don't know, he gonna take it serious though. He gonna get it together. Yeah, you just gotta put the battery in his back. That's all. Yeah, definitely. But um, yeah, bro. Like, I came up making music with Yak. I don't, I don't yeah. I work with my homies, bro. I don't really be too eager. Work with nobody else. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Shout out to motherfucking uh, shout out to Buns, DFA. Yeah. Definitely. What's up? 
That's about it. I say for this music thing, right? It's a lot of people that will have words for you. Type negative, positive. What's that one advice that somebody gave to you that you was like, okay, I'm going to do this shit? Niggas tell me one word, consistency, bro. Mm. That's some shit Talk I Talk to you him, feel me? What's, what's Consistency, bro. Talk you got to be fucking consistent, bro. Mm. You got to be consistent. You feel me? Like, no matter what, like, I mean, because no matter how much a motherfucker don't like you, yeah. they keep seeing your face, keep seeing your name. They ain't yeah. going to have no fucking choice yeah. but to, you feel me? Tap in. Tap in. Yeah. Like, like, that's just what it is. Like, no matter how much, like, you feel me? So, consistency, bro. I, I say to anybody, like, yo, just be consistent. You feel me? Like, definitely. I, I, you feel me? I could do better with taking my own advice. You feel mm. me? Because, okay. you know what I'm saying? I took, I, took, I took some time off from the music. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, Consistency. consistency. Be fucking consistent. Man. Very important. This shit will help out. It's very important. Word, 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 word. Another question though. What you got coming out? What's gonna come up for you? Oh yeah, like I said, like I took some time, but I've been working. Okay. You feel me? I got mad music in the cut. Mad music. When you know? driving? A lot of music. Uh, I ain't gonna get nobody to date yet. <laughs> motherfuckers gonna see this and be on my ass. I ain't yeah, got time for yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. Uh, just soon. You could tell them that. Very soon. Very soon. Huh? Very fucking soon. You feel me? It's coming. No trick. Definitely send me some records too. I'll drop them oh, shit yeah. in the. Uh, oh, you know hell I mean? yeah. Let's get hell yeah. Drop Let's connect. Club, definitely. You know Let's connect. Saying? We can do a motherfucking tape, whatever. Yeah. You feel me? I'll definitely do it. We tap in for I sure. I got enough songs for three fucking albums. So. Yeah. Yeah, let's, yeah. What type of vibes you you talking on? Everything. Now? Everything? Everything. Okay. Like different fucking sounds. Like yeah. Definitely. It's fire. You gotta, you gotta, oh. you gotta just. Tap into everything a little bit. For sure. You never know what's going to hit. Never know. Feel me? Never that's know. fire. That's fire. I'm definitely looking forward to your music. Oh, yeah. You going to fuck with it, bro. Lo- looking forward to everything that's going on with you. You know, all the uh, uh, events coming up and all that stuff. So, definitely, I'm going to definitely check out your shit for that's sure. True. Especially that record, How. Hell I'm going yeah. to tap in for sure. Hell yeah. You got any social medias you want to shout out to the people one time? Ah, shit. I want to <laughs> say one thing to Instagram. Stop, stop your bullshit. Uh-huh. Shadow banner. Instagram, stop your bullshit, tell bro. Him, tell them. Motherfuckers keep deleting my Instagrams. Like, I'm even tired of Instagram, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah. That shit, that, who wanna keep going back making new shit? Like, Shut it's annoying, up. bro. Like, Instagram, stop that weird Unless shit. Unless you're bro. doing some wild shit on there, then you know, I don't. I don't be doing no wild shit. Nothing crazy? Hell no. You bro. sure? I'm positive. <laughs> yeah. That shit is crazy. Yeah. Bro. Definitely. Yeah, Instagram, I'll be on some bullshit, but. Bullshit. Feel me? If y'all still, y'all can still go on that bitch and see. You feel me? Bands 2.0. Feel me? No underscores, no everything. Bands, Bands 2.0. 2.0. Where? YouTube Bands 2.0. Yeah, YouTube Bands 2.0. You feel me? Happy Music Bands 2.0. B A N D Z 2.0. Okay, for sure, for sure, yeah. my brother. Thank you for coming on. Thank you for chopping it up with me. Hell yeah, I mean, it's a pleasure. Make sure you check this interview out on OTCU Pod. Make sure you follow us at OTCU Pod. I'm DJ Ace. Please like, comment, subscribe, show some love. Check out Bands, his music. Check out that How. I'm going to check that out myself too, for Hi, sure. Yeah. Definitely check Hi. that out. But yeah, Hi, make yeah. sure you like, comment, subscribe. Thank y'all for another podcast. Appreciate okay. you. My guy.